Last year, 6.7 million new energy vehicles were sold globally, a year-on-year -year increase of 102.4%. But with the surge in sales, the birth defects of new energy vehicles are becoming more and more obvious, for example, a full tank of gasoline car can run 7 or 800 kilometers, and, filling a tank of 40 to 50 liters of gasoline tank only takes a few minutes, no range anxiety. But the battery electric car is limited by the characteristics of the battery, and the mass-produced super-fast charge also takes 30 minutes to an hour, and the EV range is not as long as the gas car. The battery life is not good, the battery is flammable, the charging speed is slow, and the charging pile is not popular enough. Speaking of it, you may think that the electric car is destined to be unable to surpass the gasoline car. But what I'm about to tell you in today's video is that the turnaround for electric cars is coming. That is to completely remove the liquid lithium battery and replace it with a solid state battery. What is a solid state battery? Well, let me tell you a story. On January 9, 2021, NEO announced that it will install a 150 degree solid state battery pack on the flagship sedan 87 in the fourth quarter of 2022. Two days later, NEO's market value surpassed that of BYD and Volkswagen, surpassing $100 billion making it the world's third-largest car company. At that time, NEO, a car company that had just been established for seven years, sold less than 100,000 cars a year, and had an annual net loss of over $4 billion, even without its own car factory, just relying on the statement of the press conference, mass production of solid-state batteries for vehicles in 2022, NEO has become the third-largest in the world. It can be seen how powerful the earning power of this solid-state battery is. So, what is unique about solid-state batteries? Compared with the common liquid lithium battery on the market, what advantages does the solid-state batteries have? Can NEO install solid-state batteries in the fourth quarter of this year as planned? Hi, everyone. Welcome to Auto Age. Now you are on the journey to look back at every change in the car, witness every surge in speed, and explore the mystery behind the car. Before we started today's video, please subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell. Okay, let's get started. First, let's compare solid-state batteries and liquid lithium batteries. As we all know, positive and negative electrodes, Electrolyte are the three major components of liquid lithium-ion batteries. Whether it is a blade battery, a ternary lithium battery or a chelene battery, no matter how the name changes, it is still a liquid lithium-ion battery installed on the car. Lithium ions in the electrolyte swim from the positive electrode through the separator to the negative electrode, which is charging. Conversely, lithium ions swim from the negative electrode to the positive electrode, which is discharge. They are all liquid batteries because of the presence of the electrolyte. As the name suggests, a solid-state battery replaces the liquid electrolyte with a solid state. So what's the advantages of it? Okay, I'll give you a few examples. The negative electrode of the traditional liquid lithium battery is generally graphite, while the metal lithium in the solid-state battery can directly act as the negative electrode. The solid-state battery can be made thinner without the need for the graphite of the negative electrode and the so-called separator. Moreover, compared with traditional negative electrodes, the gram capacity of metallic lithium is relatively high, which can theoretically reach 3,860 mAh per G, which is about 10 times that of graphite negative electrodes. Therefore, the solid-state battery can be lighter and thinner, and can be customized, and the energy density of the single battery is much higher than that of the traditional liquid battery. Of course, these advantages will eventually translate into longer battery life. Having said that, 
The stability of solid-state batteries is also several orders of magnitude higher than that of liquid lithium batteries. The reason why electric vehicles are tend to explode is because the liquid lithium battery has been used for a long time or has been operated with high current for a long time, such as rapid charging and discharging, and lithium dendrites are prone to appear inside the battery. Lithium dendrite is like a needle that slowly grows out of the negative electrode, over time, this needle will continue to grow longer and longer to the point where the electrolyte's diaphragm is punctured and the battery is short-circuited. In addition, liquid electrolytes are easy to burn, and may generate flammable gas at high temperatures. Once the temperature is out of control, it may cause smoke, fire or even explode if it is not handled properly. In contrast, the electrolytes of solid-state batteries are all polymers, oxides, and sulfides, which are resistant to high temperature and corrosion, and are not easy to volatilize, which can basically isolate the risk of spontaneous combustion of the battery. Even if the external force penetrates, there is a high probability that there will be no rapid spontaneous combustion or even explosion. Therefore, Solid-state batteries have high energy density, are not easy to catch fire, and are light and thin. New energy vehicles equipped with solid-state batteries can easily exceed 1,000 km of battery life, which has exceeded 95% of current fuel vehicles. Last but not least, the fast charging stability of solid-state batteries beats liquid lithium batteries. At present, the fastest charging speed in the industry is the graphene-based super-fast charging battery and the sodium-ion battery in the CATL era, but it still takes 8 to 15 minutes to charge 80%. However, the solid-state battery can easily be quickly charged to 100% in 10 minutes. Coupled with the replacement mode of the solid-state battery, a solid-state battery can be replaced in 3 minutes. Then, the electric vehicle with solid-state battery completely beats the gasoline vehicle in all aspects. Speaking of this, you can understand why a solid-state battery can pull the market value of NEO to the third in the world. So, can NEO install solid-state batteries in the fourth quarter of this year as planned? If you really have this expectation, then you are still too optimistic. First of all, it needs to be clear that the solid-state battery released by NEO in the fourth quarter is not the solid-state battery I mentioned. It is a solid-liquid hybrid battery, which is an intermediate product between liquid batteries and solid-state batteries. According to the news released by NEO, its 150 kilowatt hour solid state battery uses ultra high nickel positive electrode plus pre lithiated silicon carbon negative electrode plus solid electrolyte, solid plus liquid, plus separator, which is a transitional technology from liquid to solid state battery. With the ET7 equipped with this battery, the NEDC battery life can still exceed 1000 kilometers. Although the battery life has reached the current peak of the industry, it is still not our ideal solid-state battery. It has a liquid electrolyte and the negative electrode is not metallic lithium. Of course, this can't blame NEO for playing word games. All solid-state battery technology is difficult and there are too many uncertainties. Strategy Analytic, a professional organization in the industry, just released a research report not long ago. Due to complex processes such as high temperature, there is no hope for mass production of solid-state batteries in the near future. Mass production of all solid-state batteries will be at least after 2030. Therefore, at present, lithium-ion batteries are still the mainstream in the next few years, and solid-state batteries are more like the ultimate solution for new energy vehicle batteries in the future. Okay, that's all for today. Please put your comments below, and share your insightful ideas with other people. Do you want to learn about more auto stories? Please keep following our channel and like our videos.
Thank you so much for your continuous support. Your precious time with us is highly appreciated. See you.